Lucas Media. So by now everybody knows that Ryan Garcia pulled out of the Devin Haney fight at 140 pounds for a WBC title. They were under negotiations and Ryan backs out and puts on Twitter that he ain't fighting him. He looking to fight Roller Romero after hanging out with Floyd Mayweather. Well, Ryan Garcia was asked about Roley Romero, and he said that he feels that he, he will destroy him. And I'll post a link to the article below. They also asked when they think this fight will happen, and he says May 5th. Now, just for the modern era, right? I'll just start the 2010s up. May 5th has always been for Floyd Mayweather and Canelo Alvarez. Floyd always called it a single de Mayo. And Canelo always fights in May and September. He always has those two days locked up. Now here's my thing. When it comes to this. Y'all know. I, I still don't like the fact that Ryan Garcia pulled out. Of the Devin Haney negotiations. And I, I figured he would. But you going to fight May 5th? Nah, I don't think so. I also saw an interview where Roley, he just seemed completely oblivious to everything. He wasn't really, I think it was Ellie, Ellie said back. He wasn't really answering his questions. Um, Ellie said, you got you got a lot of, you got any calls about it today? And he's like, uh, I got a lot of calls. If the fight happens, and if, I don't know, I don't believe, hey, first of all, I don't believe the fight's going to happen because... Ryan Garcia's with the Zone and Golden Boy, and Roley's with Mayweather Promotions, Al Heyman Umbrella. Yeah, they hanging out, but at the end of the day, it's business. They don't want to potentially lose that belt to to Ryan Garcia, the WBA belt, and also Oscar don't want to see Ryan Garcia get another loss. So I don't really, I'm not really, I don't see where this is going to happen anytime soon. I think Ryan's just jumping on champion after champion bandwagon at 140 just to make his name hot. Now, I do think if they were to fight, I do think Ryan will beat Roley. But I don't think this fight is going to happen anytime soon. And another reason why it's not is because Canelo has still got one more fight with the PBC. And Ryan's on the zone. The zone's not going to lose money unless somehow they merge together. Like how they did with uh, Tank Davis and Ryan Garcia. But Ryan would have to fight on the undercard or be some type of co-main event. You're not going to be... You're not going to have your own standalone pay-per-view for May 5th. Not yet. And I keep saying this. Ryan got to be a champion first. Yeah, he has a name, but <laughs> he don't even have a belt. But yeah, I'm still disappointed in Ryan. Like I said, him and Devin Haney going back and forth. Um, I'm going to post this article. Even if y'all read this article, I'm not really feeling it. They talking about Devin. The only person Devin might be able to fight is Boots. Come on now, no. Devin going to he, he gonna stay at 140 more likely for a little while. Try to collect some belts. I know it's going to be a lot of people ducking and dodging. Even though he was undisputed at 135 and now a champion at 140. But I do see him staying down there for a while. But overall, I think Ryan Cappen. This ain't, like I said, this ain't the first time he does stuff like this. Remember when he said he was going to spar Manny Pacquiao in the exhibition and Manny Pacquiao said he had no idea what he was talking about? This is the same guy now. But I just want to make a quick video about it. Ryan trying to eye May 5th. Do y'all think this fight is even going to happen? And if it do, is it going to be May 5th? Tell me what y'all think.